With the 2023 season just around the corner, I'm going to try and predict every race winner of the season. I tried this back in 2020, but none of the races ended up happening, so this year I'm trying it again. I've written the script for this video on the first day of pre-season testing, so we'll see how wrong we are come November. I'm not counting the sprint races, just the actual races, so let's get into this. Bar rating. And round one of the season, I think this will be won by Charles Leclerc. Although Red Bull were unstoppable last season, I think Ferrari will have a strong start before they probably bottle it again as the season goes on. But Leclerc won last year and I see no reason why he won't do it again. Saying that now though, it will definitely be Verstappen who wins, but I'm sticking with Leclerc. Then we head to Saudi Arabia and the winner of the Saudi Arabia Grand Prix will be Max Verstappen. He won it last year. Red Bull was so strong at high speed tracks last season and I think they're going to be even stronger this year it may be close with Ferrari but Ferrari will probably bottle the strategy and will hand the win to Max Verstappen so repeat of the first two race winners of last year then we go to Australia and George Russell I think will win the Australian Grand Prix or I hope will win the Australian Grand Prix as a Mercedes fan it was very painful last season so I'm really hoping they're back this season looking at last season they were very good around the twisty tracks like your Singapore's, your Zamvorts and Brazil's of course they won there so I think George will win the race round four into backing out and I've gone with a driver that always has been very quick round Baku got podiums and a win around the streets of Baku and that driver of course is Sergio Perez granted it could depend on where Verstappen is in the race as he'll probably be told to pull over to let Max win but if Max is out of it maybe he gets wiped out of the first corner I think Perez will win the race. F1 then heads to Miami for the second time for hopefully a more interesting race than last season and maybe a proper marina as well. I think this is where the winning run of different drivers comes to an end as Max Verstappen will pick up his second win of the season in Miami. Next up is Imola and I think Carlos Sainz who didn't get past the first corner in last season after his crash with Ricardo I think will win the very long title Grand Prix. I know Red Bull have been very strong over the past couple of races but I think this could be one of the only races where Ferrari finally get the strategy right and win. Maybe there might be a bit of rain as well to mix it up. To Monaco now and I think Leclerc could win his home Grand Prix if he gets pole again like the last two seasons as long as Ferrari get the strategy right and Leclerc doesn't put it into the wall. Coming into Spain now and I think George Russell will pick up his second win of the season. Mercedes murking that dog of a car last year but very strong in Spain maybe they could get the win. Then we head to Canada and I think that Lewis Hamilton will win his first race of the season at the track where he took his first race with back in 2007 it will be win 104 as it'll be his first race win since Saudi Arabia in 2021 as a Hamilton fan I really would hope he wins before this but I don't think he will so I'm hoping this will be the race he gets his first win in a very long time next we go to the Red Bull ring in Austria where I think this will be dominated by Max Verstappen although he didn't win last year but he's always been so quick around Austria with the Dutch fans there as well I can't see anyone else winning that Grand Prix. Next up the British Grand Prix and the best Grand Prix of the season will be won by Lewis Hamilton. His second win of the season and I think his eighth win at Silverstone as well. Next up we go to Hungary and after a very good race last season I think this could be a three-way fight for the win but ultimately it will be Max Verstappen who wins. Red Bull will probably get the strategy bang on again. Ferrari probably drop the ball again and Mercedes will just be there in the mix just existing in but I think it will be won by Max Verstappen. The last race and before the summer break in Spa for the Belgium Grand Prix. Not the best of Grand Prix last season but at least we got a race but I think this will be another win for Verstappen but this could be the stage of the season where penalties start to come into play but that probably won't affect Verstappen as it didn't last season. First race back after the summer break and second half of the season at the Dutch Grand Prix. The Orange Army will see their man Max Verstappen win again three seasons in a row and three wins in a row this season that no one else will win that Grand Prix unless Verstappen engine pops he's winning that Grand Prix 
without a doubt. Then we go back to Italy in Monza where Ferrari and Leclerc will get their first win since the Monaco Grand Prix. It is one of the most incredible things to watch Ferrari win at Monza unless he's fighting with Mercedes but I think Leclerc will win in Monza. Sergio Perez won Singapore last season but I think this will be Max Verstappen this year. Mercedes might be in the in the mix and Ferrari as well but Max Verstappen will win it. Japan now and Max Verstappen will pick up another win and will be back to back wins in Japan but unlike last year I don't think this will be the one where he wins the world title. Then we go to Qatar after the World Cup. It was Lewis Hamilton who won last time and I think it will be Charles Leclerc who wins this season. Then we go back to America for the second time. We go to America for the US Grand Prix at Kota. Lewis Hamilton nearly won it last year and I think it could be this year where he does win it. He's always been quick round Austin and won his sixth world title here and I think he'll win the Grand Prix this year next to Mexico and will probably be the most dull race of the season. It was last year. Now I would like to see Perez win his home GP but Max is so quick round Mexico so I think he will win the 2023 Mexican Grand Prix. I also think this will be the race where he is crowned a three time world champion of the world. In Brazil the gloves will be off and will be another great race. I think this will be another strong weekend for Mercedes like last season and George Russell will get back to back wins in Brazil. An ultimate round of the season now for the third time in America for the Las Vegas Grand Prix for the first time. I think as we haven't been here before it could be crazy race lots of incidents and will give us a surprise winner with Lando Norris getting his first F1 win. For the final time and round 23 of 2023 we finish the season in Abu Dhabi. I think this will be your typical Abu Dhabi Grand Prix and will be won by Max Verstappen to round out another championship winning season. So then that means Max Verstappen will get 10 wins this season, Leclerc will get 4, George Russell will get 3, Perez and Sainz will both get 1 win, Lewis Hamilton will get 3 wins and Lando Norris will get 1 win as well. So then that's who I think will win every Grand Prix of 2023. Let me know down in the comments who you think will win each Grand Prix. I think this video will come out on the Friday for the Bahrain Grand Prix. So maybe the first time you're watching this video you already know who wins the Bahrain Grand Prix. But we'll see how wrong I am in November when the season is all over.